Hello everyone. Today we are going to discuss some problems from the topic profit and loss. A man buys an article for twenty seven point five zero rupees and sells it for twenty eight point six zero rupees. Then find the gain percentage. So we know the formula. Selling price is equals to hundred plus gain percentage. Divided by hundred into cost price. So let us substitute whatever is given. A man buys an article, so this will become cost price, and sells it for this amount. So this will be selling price. So under the selling price, twenty eight point six zero is equals to hundred plus gain percentage. We don't know. So as it is by hundred. Into cost price is given as twenty seven point five zero. Now this is multiplication. If I take to another side, it will become division. So we will get twenty eight point six zero divided by twenty seven point five zero, which is equals to hundred plus gain percentage by hundred. Now this is division. I will take this side will become multiplication. Twenty eight point six zero by twenty seven point five zero into hundred is equals to Hundred plus gain percentage. After decimal, two digits are there. Here we are multiplying with hundred, which has two zeros. So this decimal point will be removed. So we will get twenty-eight six zero by twenty-seven point five zero is equals to hundred plus gain percentage. Twenty-eight sixty by twenty-seven point five zero is one not four. One not four is equals to hundred plus gain percentage. So gain percentage is four percentage. That is one not four minus hundred. Okay, let's look at one more question. A person incurs five percent loss by selling a watch. For eleven hundred and forty rupees. So in this case, he gave first loss percentage. Loss percentage is given as five percentage, and selling selling price is given as eleven hundred and forty rupees. So we will use the formula again. Selling price is equals to hundred minus loss percentage by hundred into cost price. Selling price is given as eleven hundred and forty is equals to hundred minus loss percentage is five by hundred into cost price. We need to find out. So we will get eleven hundred and forty is equals to hundred minus five ninety five by hundred into cost price. We want cost price, so take this total ninety five by hundred to the another side. This will become reciprocal. Eleven hundred and forty into ninety five by hundred will become hundred by ninety five, which is the cost price. Next. At what price should the watch be sold to earn five percent profit? Selling price is equals to hundred plus gain percentage by hundred into cost price. Now in this case we need to find out the selling price. Hundred plus gain percentage given as five percentage by hundred into cost price is. Hundred into sorry, hundred by ninety five into eleven hundred and forty. We will get hundred plus five one not five by hundred into hundred by ninety five into eleven hundred and forty. Here whatever we got cost price, that's as it is. I'm substituting here. Here hundred hundred cancel. So one not five into eleven forty whole divided by ninety five is. Twelve hundred and sixty rupees. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you, everyone.